Mikhail. She's just trying to find herself. Oh. She doesn't know who she is. <laughs> and, uh, Brother Mikhail Savenko is one member of the Champaign-Urbana community who says he is happy about the upcoming Trump presidency. We're really excited about that Donald Trump is now the new president, so we're uh, very proud about that. We're happy about that. We're here to encourage the students uh, to back up his policies, to support him. Uh, we believe he's the God's man for the job. Savenko says he supports Trump's trade and immigration policies. He and other preachers engage with students on the quad every day. They preach Christian beliefs, often drawing large crowds of students who argue that his rhetoric is offensive and homophobic. Today, however, the crowd is even more boisterous than normal. I'm standing here in front of a very large crowd of students. Savenko has actually been preaching on the quad for most of the semester. However, this is one of the largest crowds that has occurred all year. Most of the comments have been fueled by post-election results. Many students challenged Savenko on his Trump support. Sophomore Ernest Lucius says that the election win has emboldened Trump supporters who are coming out to antagonize and provoke. It's important to realize that this system is like it's stacked against us, minorities, like, like people of color, LGBT people, like people of lower classes. And what it really comes down to is, is white supremacy. Despite the debates, Savenko hopes to convince students of Trump's ability to lead the country. I'm here to encourage these students over here so they would become Christians, they would support Donald Trump so we can work together and make this country great again. The University of Illinois Police Department was called about the disturbance on the quad. Although police monitored the situation, Savenko was allowed to continue preaching due to freedom of speech. In Urbana, I'm Zyla Renfro, UI7 Newsbreak. Hold on, hold on. I'm not saying I support what you're saying.